I came back from a weekend away uh, about, uh, about three weeks ago. I really hung over and there was, I had three parking tickets on my car for parking in a bay I've actually got a permit for. I couldn't believe what I was seeing, right? 190 quid, three permits. I thought, what the fuck is this? Turns out what had happened, just before I'd gone away, I'd shut the door to my car. The wind caused by me doing this had made a pen display ticket flip over and it had landed on the corner of the permit. It blocked about a millimetre. You can still see all of the details, clear as day, but you know what these fuckers are like. They're on commission, mate, aren't they? <laughs> He's obviously seen an opportunity. He goes, oh, that's technically obscured. Someone's having a ticket. Because I left it for three days, three tickets, 190 quid. I thought, I'm not fucking having this, mate. I'm appealing. I phoned up, I said, this is unbelievable. I've been given three parking tickets for parking in the bay outside of my house. Sent him a picture. He said, you can still see the details. This is ridiculous. He said, Mr. McCaffrey, calm down. He said, I must tell you very clearly at the beginning of this call, it does say quite clearly on the terms and conditions of that permit, it needs to be clearly displayed at all times. You have failed to do this, the ticket stand. I said, it's 190 quid, mate. It's nearly Christmas. Can you just be reasonable for five minutes? Yeah. But these people aren't reasonable, are they? They're arseholes. I said, look, you can see, he said, listen. He said, all of those tickets should have been charged at 70 pounds. The first one has only been charged at 50. I think you've actually done rather well there. I said, you're absolutely right, mate. How incredibly, uh, how ungrateful of me. It's incredible value. 190 pounds for parking in a bay. You got a valid permit for us to stick me on the mailing list, mate. I'd hate to, I'd hate to miss out on any other special offers. I said, what the fuck have you got on next month? Two for one fly tipping vines for sticking rubbish in your own dustbin. He said, don't be sarcastic, Mr. McCaffrey. I said, all right, how's this? You're a prick. <laughs> You're an idiot. You're a moron. He said, don't you speak to me like that. I said, well, I was going to call you a cunt. I think you've actually done rather well there. <laughs>